Kasi dalawang upper o oh. oh. nakasulat. Sa, sa left. Sa left. Okay, so for the first one is the apex of our lungs. 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 So it's in between, in between the, the, the clavicle. clavicle. So the right and left upper lobe is located on second intercostal, second intercostal space. Oh, so um, our right lobe is composed of has have three lobes yung dalawa is yes. dalawa yung three ah uh, dalawa ay tatlo yung lobes ng right natin so on the right we have middle may meron meron siyang middle lobe na tinatawag so on the counterpart ng right middle lobe natin is on left left okay. upper lobe pa din so ah uh, kaya pala tutugtog siya yung double yung left ano pa rin nasakop niya na then um sa fourth after ng siya. after ng right upper lobe a uh, right middle lobe is our right and left Lower. lower lobe located on six sixth intercostal space six intercostal space and it's mid axillary so the yung shape locate niyo lang yung yung six intercostal space and yes yes sir punta mo na ako ng so and we will auscultate the right lower lobe so make sure you check the patient too Okay. So after the chest, after ng lungs, after ng lung sounds, we will assess the back assessment. Back assessment. The back. So on the back assessment, we will assess the coccyx area for any redness. And if it's red, it signifies that patient is developing bed sore. Bed sore. Coccyx area. First stage of. Okay. So after that, we'll put the patient, we will allow the person with the abdominal assessment. So we'll put the patient in the yeah. lying position. Lying position. Oh. Take, take all the cards. Okay, so make sure you apply the proper way of okay. proper, proper positioning. Huh? <laughs> so for the, uh, take off the other garment. For the, abdominal, for the abdominal assessment, uh, the, the sequence will start with inspection, inspection auscultation, percussion, percussion palpation, palpation. This is because we were trying to avoid the alter sounds. The abdomen, so make sure you still provide privacy on your patient. So uh, for the abdomen, the the, the color of the abdomen is fine, and I'm not seeing any skin breakdown, any irritations, or redness of the area. And now we'll um, proceed with auscultation. So auscultation, uh, we will auscultate for the bowel, for the abdomen, we'll auscultate for the bowel sounds and the vascular sounds. Okay, so for the bowel sounds, the normal bowel sounds is Five to thirty bowel sounds per minute, minute. per quadrant. Per quadrant. Five to thirty. Five to thirty bowel sounds per quadrant. Five to thirty bowel sounds per minute per quadrant. So we'll start with the right. We'll start with the right. Uh, right so upper we'll right. Right, right lower low. Right lower quadrant. 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 Um, Oscultic D. Anong dito ng area nga dyan? Nakasulat? For the vascular sounds, below the siphoid process. Oscultic da. The, the, the siphoid. Uh, artery. 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 So this one is our is our Parang si Mura sir. Kuto kuto. 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 Kuto kuto.
Glued sa kalabang. It's our aortic artery. And right, left, renal artery. Right, right and left. So, uh, ito ba tayo below, tal below talaga siya sa rib cage? Below, sa, below talaga siya sa di ba, rib cage to. Tapos di ba may cyphoid process tayo dyan? Yes. Below siya sa cyphoid process. So, Tapos, yung, pag ganyan na lang siya. Rich dito. Tapos may cyphoid process dito yung, di ba, may parang may part dyan. Oh, ano dyan mali. Then yung, yung soft na part dyan, that's where the nice soft seat. Okay. 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 Tapos, ito na lang siya. Then, we have the right. Right and left. Right and left. Right and left. Yeah. Left right hand. Left right hand. And we have the word right left artery. Ang elia. Elia is below the elia. Ah, below the elia. So below the cyphoid process, right, right renal artery, left renal artery, and we have ah, right or left, ah, right. Yeah. So we have right left, right left, right left, right left, Okay, so after the vascular sounds, we'll now proceed with percussion. percussion. So for percussion, we have the light and deep palpation. Light, six, I use it The percussion, the percussion will percuss our using our using our fingers. Fingers inside. Two fingers here. Percuss. So we'll. Percast starting from the right lower artery, like right lower artery. Right, right lower right quadrant. Right lower quadrant. That was so upper. We will from. We will percast. Anong anong ayong sa ibaba? Anong part, left or right? Right. Right. So right, right. lower quadrant. So then we will tap it. Ah, okay. Ito may sound na siya. So upper. So kung ano ang ano sir kung Na, may gas, ano, accumulation meron, sa kaan. Ano ang tunog, meron, sir? Parang ano siya, meron siya. Sa drum, uh, sa brain. Alam mo yung nakita, ano? Tingnan nyo nga yung... Parang, parang, parang ganyan, yung ano ba? Yung parang tamboy. Yun, know? oh. Oh, ganyan. Oo. Oh. Iba yan. Parang hinog ng langka. Ako ba? Hinog ng langka. Iba yan. Wala. Ganito yung sounds na, sir, yung may gas. Ha? Iba na. Iba hey. yung gas. <laughs> alam mo yung, alam mo yung sound na ano, yung... Pag matigas yung pinapercast natin ang object, di ba? Kaya nga pinapa-identify ko sa inyo, pinapa-familiarize ko sa inyo yung mga organs na specific doon sa right lower quadrant. Para at least pag alam mo kung kung solid yung sound niya, iba yung sound ng solid. Iba yung, di ba? Alam niyo naman pag walang laman, di ba? May space sa loob, iba ang sound. Or may mga ascites or may fluids sa loob, iba yung sound. So anong organ ang nasa right lower? Ang pulmon. Ha? Right lower. Right lower, nanjan yung kidney. Right appendix. 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 Nakalimutan ko kanina i. First, before we start with any sequence, first we need to ask our patient. Sabi ko i inform niya ako ng ano wala talaga na. Ano sir? About sa first we'll inform, we will ask after the inspection we'll ask our patient if. Allergies. Okay, so when was your last urination? Okay. Last urination. Okay. So when was your last urination? Okay. So when was your last urination? Okay. So when was your last urination? Okay. Hindi kasi dyan yung pagkain. Ano na, kung sabi ba, ano yung isa? 
Yes, so, binigay ko ng picture. Binigay ko. Yeah. As you can see in the picture, nilagay ko ng picture. Yung, this one is the peg tube. Yung may tube na nakatouch. And ito yung colostomy bag. Colostomy bag to the sa left side? Any, er, any, ano, any part of our colon. Ito yung colon natin, di ba? Nakaganyan. Oh, yeah. So, kung saan yung may damage, sa saan yung may mga damage, doon siya. Doon siya ilalagay. Ang peg tube din? Ang peg tube pa ito sa peg tube, sir. Yung peg tube, pero most of the time. Depende kasi di parehas. Hindi di parehas. For for what ba nang pronounce? Yung food. Karamihan na ano. Peg tube, peg tube. Sa ano, usually sa stomach man kasi, gitna man kasi yung ano natin. Kasi minsan din ba doon ni dadaan yung kain. Any area. Any area. Inject sa ano, inject at bulsa. Okay, so yun ha, yung allergies, yung ano, nakalimutan ko, wala pa nang nagsabi sa atin. Sige lang sir, kasi binabasar man ang tubo. Yun, After na Ano <laughs> Right, so we will we will for lower, right lower, right lower, upper, right upper. That's why you should recognize the organs that are there. Para, because it should be. Di ba sa kidney? Sound is there. Solid ba yung sound? Hollow or fluid field or may ear? Ano sa? May mga lamang angin ganon. Alam niyo naman yung ano ng ano. Then right lower, right upper, right upper, then left lower. Then after that, we'll proceed with palpation. So our palpation has two types. We have light and light. It's 2 cm. 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 Okay, so then we proceed with the tip of five centimeters. So make sure you properly inspect the the abdomen before you palpate, because if there's like inflammation on the right lower quadrant of our patient, possible patient is having or developing an appendix or inflammation of the appendix. So for the right the palpation, dip four to five centimeters. Then, about the then about about patient, I'm not seeing any. I didn't palpate any masses on the or lumps on on the area, and it's normal. Then we'll proceed with lower extremities. So for the lower extremities. Same like what we do on our legs and feet. Like what we do on our upper extremities. So first, we will assess the color of the upper extremities, and our lower extremities includes our legs and our feet. Okay. So we'll check for the color of the legs. We will check for the color of the legs. The color is fine. The size, the size of the legs, it's symmetrical. It's the same size. And I'm not seeing any and skin breakdown. There is a there is a minimal amount of hair on the legs for the male. Kung ano yung nakita niyo kung may mga tatu ng yan. So in inspection talaga same lang lahat from head to toe. Same fresh lang color, ulit lang. Symmetry, symmetry ang color niya. Masayang yung texture. Yan yung siya makita niyo na. So so sabi niyo kung ano yung color. Then after that, we will perform the we will perform capillary refill. Both feet, two seconds. Capillary fill, and capillary fill again is for the oxygenation. Oxygen. Oxygen. And I, I don't know. I don't know. Rains. Rains. Then we'll do the skin turner for the hydration status of our patient. Then we'll do our OM exercises as well. Then we'll check the. 